A world-class sports competition is happening right now in downtown Spokane at the podium. About 480 athletes, including Olympians and gold medalists, are competing at the USA Track and Field Indoor Championships. It's a two-day event expected to rake in millions of dollars for the Lilac City, helping boost our local business during a generally slow season. Ellen e. Dow gives us a look at how businesses are doing as more big events come back to Spokane. Spokane Sports estimates the podium will bring in $20 million since it opened in mid-December all the way through March 1st. One business nearby tells me it's already seeing the benefits of this place opening up. The last two years have been rocky for businesses, but things are finally looking up. Sean O'Donnell's is reaping in the benefits of being so close to many different big venues. The podium, the Spokane Arena, and soon the new downtown stadium. Bringing people from the podium in, it's been an amazing experience for people to kind of see what the Inland Northwest can offer, especially in the way of Irish pub fare. Sean O'Donnell's saw an increase in people coming in to dine in at the Irish pub since the podium opened. A lot of people from out of town. I love hearing people's stories. So as we do that and we meet and greet and talk at the tables, we've learned a lot of people are not from here, which has been really kind of cool to hear their stories. At least a thousand people are coming from out of town to go to the 2022 USA Track and Field Championship. That's only between athletes and officials with the USATF. Some have families coming in to watch the athletes. And with so many people, Spokane Sports says the Track and Field Championship alone is bringing in $5.3 million with people staying in hotels, shopping in local businesses, and eating in restaurants like here. So our whole purpose um, at Spokane Sports is to be an economic driver, and we do that through sports tourism. So to send business, especially to restaurants and small businesses in December, January, February, March, you know, a time frame that isn't a, a high tourism season for our city, that's amazing. More events are on the way. Spokane Sports gearing up for the Pacific Northwest Qualifier and the Spokane Arena with Sir Paul McCartney. With big names and big events planned, businesses are excited to see what's coming, trying to bounce back from COVID. Spokane is really on the cusp of becoming a pretty big, fun place to be. And uh, with all the neat entertainment and the podium, it's just going to grow our community and our businesses. In Spokane, Eleni Dow, 4 News Now.